Charlie on here talking about some road rage. I just want to see what it is. You feel me? Miami road rage is special. I've made no secret that Miami is one of my least favorite places I've ever visited. I've been there about three times now, and every single time it's a nightmare. It's extremely expensive for anything. I remember going there for spring break in college, and a single beer was 18. Do we need to do an IRL stream in Miami, chat? I still want to go. I feel like when Simba leave, we can just fly to Miami for real. Tight shit. You know what I'm saying? In clams. I will never forget that price because it had my eyes popping out of my skull like it was Looney Tunes. It was unbelievable. I also hate how crowded it is. So if and you're trying to go five miles by car, you're better off just hopping on a f***ing unicycle. You'll get oh. there significantly oh. faster. It's like it that. takes like an hour to just go a handful of miles. And it's a cacophony of annoying noise because people are constantly like hitting their horn. Like they, they need that more than oxygen. So if you're in I mean, like the Miami the vibes, Beach area, man, you know it just sounds saying? like you're being skull f by an air horn at all times. I, I have not had a good experience any of the times I've visited, but there is one thing Miami is very well known for that I'm very well aware of. What's that? And that's road rage. I seen this. I seen this the other day. I seen this the other day. Like, to get out of your car and do something, do anything, throw a water bottle, hit a mirror off, walk up to somebody's window. You gotta be like, have anger issues. Like everybody get a little frustrated driving, but like to get out the car and act a nut with all these camera phones everywhere. I, why, he, why did he jump like that? <laughs> you know what it is? He didn't know what he wanted to do. He didn't know what he wanted to do. He wanted to hit the hood. And then he, you know, he didn't know what he wanted to do. And all you driving is a Corvette, bro. Watch Soft it. top at that, bro. Get the hard top, twin. What we doing? Full speed, it really felt like he stayed in the air longer and got higher, but when I went back and like froze frame, <laughs> he didn't get no that vert. high off the ground at all. No it's vert. Like he got in the air and then started lagging like there was a ping issue. But, and now your dumb ass got to fix your shirt. Now you got to go to work or wherever you was going. You got to retuck your shirt because you wanted to be Mr. Angry Guy. Off the ground at all. It's like he got in the air and then started lagging like there was a ping issue. But this gentleman here jumps up with a flying hammer fist and fucking judo chops and I know his the hand off of this car. I know in his a hand road rage incident. This video has been going viral over the last 24 hours and it had me giggling. Also, the caption that I saw with it, it was posted by Barstool Sports when I the first saw it. And the caption said, this man put the mirror on a poster. Even that had me laughing. But just the way that he the leaps show? into the air like Darius Alting out of League of Legends, just to come down with like a fucking full force <laughs> asteroid and blast the mirror off the car. Oh my god, it was it was the thing of legend. I, I ain't gonna lie, he should have kicked the mirror. That would've been hard. If he would have kicked the mirror and that bit went flying, that would have been kinda hard. I ain't gonna lie. He looked kinda goofy jumping in the air with no vertical jump, you know what I'm saying? Speaking of, you know what I'm saying? I think since we got the Mikey show. I think it's time we start training our vertical jump so we can dunk on Aaron every time we play basketball with the crew, you feel me? The teabag Philly real quick. Ah, bitch! You feel me? <clears throat> yeah! I don't know how hard it is to do that, by the way. I don't know if this oh, is a display trust me, of trust me, trust me, trust me. I've done it once before. I could do it again. I'm a little older. It might take a little longer. You know what I'm saying? Oh, it shouldn't take too long. It shouldn't take that long. It's really a matter of I think I got 20 pounds to get off me. You feel me? Because you know what I'm saying? I've been eating. I've been eating. I've been eating real good. You feel me? Get these 20 pounds off me. I can still touch the rim, no problem. So really all I needed when I was in my heyday was like, you know, that's a lot, but like, <laughs> it's a lot, but it ain't a lot. You feel me? So like, I get these 20 pounds off me. In the midst of doing that, get back on the plyos and obviously the strength, core strength, leg strength. You know what I'm saying? Get back to, I feel like I can do it. I did it once before. You feel me? I ain't like lost everything. I ain't lost everything. So like when I, when I did it the first time, the dunk training, I started from zero. But this time I'm not technically starting from zero. 
because I still know what I need. I know what I need to do to get there. I just gotta, you know what I'm saying? Only thing really hold me back is a little more age, you know what I'm saying? More more miles on the bones, you feel me? But like, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 I you know, what I, mean? I still got it though. Still my fault. That's martial arts <laughs> prowess or not. But I do remember when I was a kid, I accidentally did this to my parents' car mirror after I shot a basketball and it caught the front of the rim and hit right into the mirror. Right, so I don't right. even think it takes that much force. I just feel like most people don't bother to do that. And I know his hand was probably sore. That shit yeah, but his hand hurt. Probably looked like Tom's hand out of Tom and Jerry he after had to he play hits it, off, it with though. a mallet or something. What did yeah. happen? Did anything else happen? Oh, she got his license plate. Yeah, 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 yeah. And they was recording, so you got backup. Damn! And he gonna drive out. Oh! I wish he would have. I wish he would have. I wish. Well, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna say that. But like, cause it was it's another person involved, so that would have sucked for them. But like, I kind of wish he would have hit like a pole or something, trying to skirt off at the hit. You know what I'm saying? Doing the mirror being scary. Hit the pole. Now you fucked too. You feel me? You know? Yeah, that's that's, that's you know. <laughs> Don't worry, there is a video. All right, chat. We just confirmed the college football wager against Carmen is happening in, at about two o'clock, roughly two o'clock. You feel me? Of it. She and just I told also me. Also, imagine the high octane cocaine grandmaster into the fist would also want a copy of that as well. That boy was I at, bet he would want to post home. this on his fucking LinkedIn. At home, he like, probably thought this was the hypest uh, shit imaginable. So I don't know the context with what led to it. it. Seems just like classic road rage, but it starts with her throwing some kind of like plastic water bottle at him or something. It looks like the squirt bottle from Space Jam or something with the secret stuff, and it misses. But it was still enough to trigger his super That's... soldier programming. He did that from a water bottle being thrown, nigga, dude. A water bottle. I mean, f whatever happened on the road. A water bottle. Aaron wouldn't let that slide. What happened to Twitch? What, what aren't we on Twitch? What are we talk? What are we talking about? The group Twitch? We still streaming on there? Probably. Well, he want to stream tomorrow, but we could do tonight. But hey, you know what I'm saying? I just got my own. You know what I'm saying? So he like NPC jogs over there and gets her with the fucking. I can't have his own Twitch. Damn, nigga. Damn, nigga. A nigga can't have his own Twitch in this bitch. I can't have my own account. ammo right on the car mirror and then goes back to his vehicle and turns away an incredible series of events here <laughs> I, I don't know if there's more to the story but goodness gracious what a fucking goofy thing to capture on camera and speaking of goofy since i use the word goof juice my game is flavor available right now best i think that's the pretty much the full story did he talk about another road rage incident oh he did oh no there's more oh no hey gamer sucks you know what I'm saying? You feel me? We'll do you right. You know what I'm saying? We can make our own flavor, baby. I, I can make a furry flavor for real. You tight shit out. You know what I'm saying? Hey, gamer sucks, bro. What we talking about? Tight shit, tight shit. Best flavor shit. of anything ever made, I promise. Film bear Go to flavor, yeah. GG slash moist to get some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, yeah. I want to also take you through memory lane here and right, Miami right, right. road rage history. To bring you what I think to be one of the best instances of road rage that's ever been captured. This okay. was quite a few years ago now, 
and it's something special. Show me You've something. You've likely heard of the term Whoa! catching a ride, but it looks like this guy may have snagged more than he bargained for. At speed. Hey, yo, Matt, if you edit in this, go ahead. Go ahead and censor that. That's crazy. Hey, we just gonna end that right there. That's crazy. Whoa.